I just got invited to the board of directors as the youngest board member in the company history. Wow. So, what's new with you? Nothing much. I just finished integrating this optical MEMS chip into an iPhone camera lens and synchronized it with the image capture system. So we came up with the world's first hyperspectral mobile device. Why? What's it for? Well, in itself, nothing. But when it's with a mobile phone, it can actually be used to analyze food. Like if a company wanted to develop an app and check the food is edible. So it's a consumer app? Mm, not entirely. It can be used to diagnose skin cancer, identify users with biometric data, and it can even be used to measure vessel emissions remotely. Seriously? One tiny filter yeah. in a pre-existing camera yeah. can do all that? Yeah. Where do you actually work? At VTT. We simply set our targets a bit higher. So, I just won a deal and made loads of money and got promoted to head of department. So, how about you? Uh, you were into AI and robotics and something. <laughs> you done anything useful with that? Oh, well, it's early stages yet, uh, but I've been developing these algorithms that combine all this fragmented data generated during the treatment of heart attack patients. Then we applied machine learning to analyze it, and we came up with a solution that can be used to monitor high-risk heart patients after surgery and catch any complications. You're saving lives now. Well, I just use artificial intelligence to support doctors in decision-making. Sure, it also increases patient safety and, and cuts down treatment costs. Wow. Where did you say you work? At VTT. We simply set our targets a bit higher. <laughs>